What's poppin' YouTube family? It's your girl Deanna Beauty back at it again with another tutorial. So today we're gonna learn how I edit my makeup photos. These will be the five photos I'm editing from a look that I created and the full tutorial on this look will be uploaded on my YouTube channel right after I post this video. So stay tuned. First thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and up my vibrant straight from the photo. This is the best way to add more color into your picture especially after taking it with a ring light and a whole lot of lighting, you can definitely look a little washed out. Now we're gonna go ahead and head into our Facetune 2 app to smooth out our picture. This is the main function that I use on the Facetune 2 app. And when I smooth, I never smooth to 100%. I always turn my, my percentage down till about 80. You can keep it anywhere between 50 and 80 depending on your preference. I never smooth out my highlight just because I want to leave that detail there because your highlight is supposed to be detailed. So you don't want to smooth it out and then it looks extremely fake. Now that our photos are smooth, we're gonna go ahead and go to our Beauty Plus app. And this app is specifically to enhance my makeup look. So I use it to enhance my eyebrows, a little bit of my eyeshadow, and add a little bit more blush. But I'm gonna show you different functions that this app has also. You can whiten your teeth, you can contour your face more. This, this app definitely does it all. So now that we have our picture finished, we're gonna go head back into the Facetune app and I am gonna go and re-whiten my eyeliner and my eyes just because I feel like the Beauty Plus app did not do it that much of a justice. And I'm gonna take it all the way up because I want it to be extremely white. After that, I'm gonna go ahead and edit my background. I'm gonna show you how to edit your background without actually paying for it. So since this look is from Crayon Case palettes, and products, I am gonna be editing crayon case into the background. And you're just gonna erase that up and fix it so that it doesn't e take up your face and that it looks like it's an actual, like you just took a picture against that wallpaper. And once I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and screenshot the picture and then just crop out all the excess stuff that I don't need. And this is how I get my background for free. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the bell so the next time I upload so you never miss a look. 
and let me know down in the description bar below if you want to see more editing videos on how I basically edit my content for my channel and these are my final pictures which will also be posted on my Instagram momentarily so don't forget to go ahead and check those out as well see you in my next video bye